The calendar has turned to February, meaning it's the start of back-to-back -back weekend play in the Ivy League. Here's Bassey setting up Towns for a good look from beyond the arc and ring that up. Towns who leads the Ivy League in scoring in league games. Going to work again and 13 on the shot clock. And ring that up from beyond the arc. Starting to gain some rhythm. Harvard looking to return the favor. And how about Corey Johnson? Shit point shooters in now. As Bassey goes to work on the baseline, out to Towns, and he connects. See whether or not they can find that magic again. Corey Johnson finds it the stroke. My goodness. Zang is dribbling right in front of him. Towns wide open. And he makes Columbia pay. He's 6'7. That showcasing his length right there again. Four of four from beyond the arc, 16 points. Let's just... And a wide open look for Jurich, and he connects. Starting left, start second half. I think that's a good idea by Jim Engels. He's got to get him going. And it'd be a good idea to zone in on Seth Towns. 10 on the shot clock. Towns goes reverse, count the bucket, plus the foul. Johnson left all alone and connects. And a lot of specials for open shots. And speaking of open shots, Corey Johnson with trifecta number five of the lead. Towns gets the three, and he's got 31 on the night. So Seth Towns has just set a new career high.